and realizing bitch you're not fat you're bloated you're bloated <laughs> sweaty hot mess from leaving the gym but let's get into the back like i never had any type of def definition right here and like do you see how like the curvature in my back is right now i didn't have that at first it was really just like back and then a little bit of butt but now you can really see the difference between back and butt thank you very much like I ain't never had no line back there, like no indent. I don't know what it's called. Yes, I still have rooms working on those, but do you see right here how it goes in? I ain't never had that before. I know that's right. <laughs> Right. Hey you guys, I'm just now realizing that I probably haven't spoken to y'all like face to face yet. So what's good? What's poppin'? Welcome back to the channel. Are you new here? Then welcome and you should subscribe. <laughs> Are you new here? My hair just kind of got messed up because I was in here jamming y'all. But anyways, welcome to, I'm not sure if this is going to be a day in the life vlog or a weekly vlog. But regardless, welcome to the vloggy vlog. I'm excited. I'm not doing too much today. I'm just taking you guys along with me to run some errands. Um, after the gym, I showered, I ate, I took a nap, and now we are at Trader Joe's because I need to get on top of my gut health, my digestive system, etc. I'm realizing, bitch, you're not fat, you're bloated you're bloated and i came across this girl on tiktok i'm not sure of her at name but she was saying that if you drink lemon or lime juice in the morning with water and salt it's really good for your digestive system if you drink cherry juice i've been put on some cranberry juice all my life i never heard of drinking cherry juice like the organic stuff that's really good for your system and then she says something else that i screenshot and hopefully i can find it and then i'm also just going to pick up like some quick lunch items to get me through the weekend going into next week and then we're gonna head over to target because i need to get some spooky season halloween pajamas also need to pick up some wine and like some adult games because my bestie is um hosting like a girl's night in halloween edition i'm so excited i may like film some of that stuff for y'all tomorrow as well so we're gonna see y'all we're gonna see what i can find um in trader joe's and target and i'm gonna take y'all along with me so let's go hey let go All this shit is Christmas. Where is the spookiness? Like, 
What, 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 what a bitch supposed to do? What, 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 what? You guys see me? I'm back home. If the quality wasn't that good at first, I'm sorry. That's because I was filming on my phone, but now I'm on my camera since I'm at home. Um, I'm about to make some food. I don't know if I'm really going to cook. I'm about to put a piece in the oven. We're going to see how I feel. But let's do a Target slash Trader Joe's haul. Why don't we? Okay, and first off, I did not film in Target because that Target that I just went to should be ashamed of themselves. Baby, when I said that thing was ran through, that thing was ran through. They must have had a sale or something because it just looked terrible. But first things first. Um... Let's do Target first because I got the least amount of stuff from Target. I got my dish pods so I can finally try out my dishwasher. I've been in my apartment for a year and I've never turned that thing on. So I'm kind of nervous. Um, I'm probably going to, should I do like a tester before I put my dishes in there? Yeah, I think the fuck so. I've never used a dishwasher. Um, Okay, I've used a dishwasher like once or twice, but... I wasn't, I didn't grow up on using dishwashers. I grew up hand washing, so that's why I never used a dishwasher before. But I'm tired of doing dishes. That's my least favorite chore. I would rather scrub a toilet before I scrub the dishes. Like, my toilet. I don't know about nobody else because I keep, I keep shit clean. But anyways, I got some wine because I'm going to a pajama party tomorrow. And I've never tried the Black Girl Magic wine, so I wanted to try it. I got this one for the party because I was like, People probably not going to think to get rosé, so I wanted to add, like, a variety. And I want to try the red blend myself, because y'all don't need two bottles of wine for me. Shoot. And everything else that I got from Target is, like, pajamas, though. So I got a set of pajamas, a robe, and some slippers. And then I got some tampons, because <laughs> I'm probably going to come on my site in, like, two, three days. But TMI. So, yeah, that's everything that I got from Target. I got me some lemons. I am going to take a shot of lemon juice every morning when I wake up um, along with my tea or some warm water to get my system going. And I'm probably going to drink a little bit of this cold press green juice. It has, what does it have in it? It has kale juice, spinach juice, apple juice, cucumber juice, celery juice, lemon juice, and ginger juice. That's a lot of juice. I low-key want to see what it tastes like right now. So I'm going to shake it out. Just so I can get my daily dose of greens in every day. This tastes good. It's kind of like really sweet. Hmm. I like bitter stuff. So I wasn't, I wasn't expecting it to be that sweet. I would probably pour my shot of lemon juice in this because this is sweet tasting by itself the most thing i taste is celery and something else that's sweet what's making it so sweet maybe the apple juice i don't know but i'm really trying to get my gut together so regardless i'm gonna drink it also got me some kombucha i'm gonna drink this when i'm craving a soda because it kind of has like a like soda acidy spritzy kind of taste if that makes any sense and then i got the 100 percent cherry juice and a girl at the uh, register was telling me that she really likes this and it's not as bitter as cranberry juice oh this is fire That tastes so good. I'm sorry for smacking in y'all face like that. That's really disrespectful of me. This tastes so good. <laughs> A bitch skin about to be on fleek. My tummy about to be on flat. I'm so excited. I got some honey because I put honey in everything. I put so much honey inside my um inside my uh my teas that is crazy like I love honey and then I I'm gonna try out this non-dairy oat creamer and it's in the flavor brown sugar I think I was watching like Brianna Monique and she said that it tastes really really good so I wanted to try it out and then in terms of food because that was like all the drinks and like stuff like that in terms of food 
I got some pesto. I'm trying to be on my Kyra on Unique shit. Y'all know she loves pesto. So, um, I was trying to think of what, like, meals and dinners or lunches, food in general, I can make over the next couple of weeks. So, I got me some tortillas because I'm going to make tacos. If you know me, you know I can eat tacos every damn day of my life. I got some eggs because... Fun fact, I love softball eggs. Those are like one of my favorite quick, easy go-to um, breakfasts to make. And then I got some arugula and parmigiano ravioli. I was thinking about grilling some chicken, cutting it up, adding the pesto, add a little bit of alfredo sauce. I think that would hit. Like, I feel like that would hit. Okay. And then, if you never know what kind of meals to get from Trader Joe's, you have to try the Mandarin Chicken. It tastes like orange chicken. It's so good. Like, if you fry it up nice and crispy in your pan with a little bit of oil, it tastes bomb. The same goes for the beef and broccoli. Fire! Tastes so good. And to make you really feel like you are getting, um... To really make it feel like you're eating Chinese for that night. I also get their um chicken spring rolls. I got two of these because I love them. And they only give you like five in each box. But they are so good. These are the best egg rolls I ever got from a grocery store, I think. And then I also got some sirloin steak tips. Because I can make two different things with this because it's just me. I'm going to cut these down. Like, I'm probably going to cut each one in fourths because they're super big. I can make steak tacos with this because, oh, dang, I will have to go get some. Dang, I ain't getting no uh, cilantro. You need cilantro on your steak tacos. But I can easily go to the store and get some cilantro for my steak tacos. And I can also make um, pepper steak and rice. Because I already got some rice. I'm going to add the rice to my beef and broccoli and my mandarin chicken as well. And then I recently found out that I love, um, what's it called? Margarita pizza. I love it. I don't know what this margarita pizza going to hit on. Chow, because it don't look as enticing as the one that I get from Harris Teeter. But I'm excited to try out all this stuff. It's currently 644, so I think I'm about to clean out my dishwasher. Because I use it, I just use my dishwasher as storage. I'm gonna take everything out, put everything away, and I'm gonna let it rinse by itself. And I'm gonna like gently hand wash my dishes and then put them in. And then I'm gonna put all these groceries away. And I'm going to decide what I want for dinner tonight. Oh, yeah. And if you like duck sauce like me, let me show y'all the best sauce to get from Trader Joe's. This shit right here. This shit right here. It made me go crazy. This is better than duck sauce. Better ass. Better than duck sauce. Okay, so why nobody ain't tell me dishwashers are loud as heck. They take just as long as a regular washing machine. Like you washing your clothes to wash your dishes. Uh, like, I'm not feeling this. But anyways, I just finished cooking. I made the chicken, um, and the chicken spinach ravioli or whatever is inside it. I put pesto in it. I put alfredo sauce in it. I sauteed some onions. I grilled my, not grilled, but like pan seared my chicken. And y'all, it tastes so stinking good. It's hot right now. You see that thing? Get grilled. Mmm. Mmm. This tastes so good. And I'm obsessed with this cherry juice. Girl, this is good. This tastes so good. I have some more behind me for tomorrow. Girl, I'm going to need seconds. I'm going to eat this, enjoy my night. I may try this Black Girl Magic wine later. I'm going to watch a show. And I will probably talk to you guys tomorrow when I'm getting ready. 
in terms of like doing my makeup and stuff for the party because I think what I'm gonna do is since I couldn't find oh I don't think I told y'all I think I showed y'all one short clip in Target there are no Halloween stuff period and I wasn't going like party city or anything like that that's champ so I just got me an all black um pajama outfit and I'm going to do my face I think I'm gonna do like a skull or a skeleton or something like some light easy makeup just so I can still be like in the spirit and participate fully and not be a whack person so yeah I'll catch up with y'all tomorrow hey you guys so it's the next day I just got out the shower and I am about to attempt to do some spooky makeup um, I'm probably gonna have to focus because it is already 7.24 and the party starts at 8. I don't really know how that just happened. Like, literally, it was just 6.30. I don't know if it was because I was on the phone with my boyfriend or what. That probably what it, what it was. And I was under the impression, like, oh, you don't have to do a full face of makeup. But it's like, what is the shadow gonna stick to type shit right so i low-key think i have to but i'm just gonna do something really quick and then i'm gonna check back in with y'all like midpoint and then like fully done okay so it's 7 32 and the base makeup is done i literally lightly filled my brows put on foundation powder contour a little bit of concealer and i just like set everything with some powder i don't even have setting spray and oh wait i didn't put on any blush that's not like me let me lightly put some on mm -hmm. that'll do that okay that'll do and now i'm gonna go into this um morphe palette and i have to try to find a brush to start applying some black shadow bro i don't even know what i'm doing and like you're dealing with black so it's like you fuck up you doubtful what side do i want to do hmm this is my good side but i'm gonna do this side because like it's gonna be easier for me to you know i'm actually a little nervous Ugh, ugh, bitch, you a bad bitch. You're not supposed to get nervous. All the pictures I saw, they were like really pigmented. And like they fill in their entire eye. So I guess I'm gonna do the same thing. Y'all need to focus. I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna a oh, bitch gonna have to come back because I need to refer to the picture and everything. Yeah, okay, this is what I'm doing. The top one. So she filled in her whole damn eye. Give me a minute. <laughs> okay, I feel like once I do the mouth part, you'll understand what I am a little bit more because right now it just looks like I got beat the fuck up. I got rocked in my eye. We're gonna do the and I'm gonna put some mascara on. I'm gonna put on damn brushes in my lip and I'm gonna put on my. And then we gotta go because it's already 7.42. <sighs> I'm stressed. What's it giving y'all? I try my best. I think it's cute. I even put on the lashes. I just sound like I was some fucking vulnerable. Cute. Okay, that's enough for him. I know. <sighs> I think I'm gonna look even cuter when I take this. Scarf off my head. Let's get into her. She's a skeleton. Okay. This will be my first time ever driving with, um, driving in slippers. But my slippers are hall bottoms. So, this set is so, like, nice fitting. Oh, my God. If it's really, really good. Um, phone's ringing. I'm about to dip, y'all. I'm about to take some pictures before I leave. And I'm gonna dip, but everything, I'm wearing a robe, too, because it's cold outside. But, yeah, everything is from Target. And this came out pretty cute, I think. Okay. Y'all, I'm really about to leave out the house like this. I show the fuck is. Okay, about to get my wine and go to my spooky Halloween party. Period. Hey y'all, 
y'all so it is the next day i think i'm gonna wrap up the video here instead of extending it because today i just want to focus on being a good daughter um i know a lot of people have like weird or awkward or maybe not the most healthiest relationships with their parents but um i'm still very much so a daddy's girl and a mommy's girl so um that's what i'm deciding to spend the day doing today um I just got back from taking my mom some flowers and spending some time with her because it's like the anniversary of her friend's death. And then my dad hit me up the other day and said that he lost one of his co-workers. So I'm just like, uh, I just want to focus on being a good daughter. So I don't want to bore y'all with anything else because I don't have much in terms of content to do for y'all. I'm actually like in the middle of filming another video for y'all because I'm always on it. Okay, I'm trying to be so disciplined. For the remainder of the year so I can go into 2023 strong. I am slowly approaching 50k subscribers. So I can't wait until I hit 50k. Like I'm going to be so excited. And I have a little surprise for y'all. It's not necessarily a giveaway. But it's going to be a lot of valuable information that I just want to put out into the world. So I'm excited about that too. And don't worry. I'm going to give y'all like the inside scoop and the behind the scenes and stuff like that. But yeah. I wanted to close out this video. Thank y'all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this like multiple daily vlog, then let me know in the comments down below. I will film more of them in the future. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye, mamas. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh.